Well, a healthy, clear cornea is critical for sight and health news, but if it becomes damaged, so can a person's vision. The solution is often a traditional cornea transplant, but for some, this type of treatment doesn't always work. A Connecticut doctor is using a cutting edge technique to give those patients the gift of sight. What I want people to get from my art is to let their imaginations flow. For Mia Eckberg, every stroke of her paintbrush gives meaning to her life. This is my main means of expression. But last year, that changed when her vision started going fuzzy. Basically, I could see movement and I could see um, colors but it would fade after a while. A decade ago, Mia suffered a severe infection in her left eye, leaving her in need of a corneal transplant. But her body rejected one operation after another. In total, five corneal transplants failed. And I had given up the possibility of even being able to to ever really see out of that eye. That's when Mia met Dr. Lorenzo Cervantes, an ophthalmologist at OptiCare. He's one of only two doctors in Connecticut board certified to perform a special type of corneal transplant. Its official name is the Boston Keratoprosthesis. Or KPRO for short. Without options like this, that eye really wouldn't have any long-term hope. While traditional corneal transplants involve removing a diseased cornea and replacing it with a donor cornea, the KPRO procedure takes it one step further by also implanting an artificial lens. The clear lens that we implant into the cornea um, is what the patient ultimately will see through. The KPRO lens is made of several parts that are attached to the donor cornea just before surgery. Each prosthetic cornea is specially made for each individual patient. The device is then sewn into the patient's eye and a contact lens is placed on it for protection. For Mia, changes were seen immediately. I was so surprised because I went in the next morning to take off the, the, you know, the shield that they put over the eye. And my vision was almost completely there. For the rest of her life, Mia will need to see a doctor once a month to change her contact and make sure everything looks okay. She also needs to use drops daily. But for her, it's a small price to pay for what she's gained. And it's a part of me that felt like it was suffocated. And it's back because of the miracle that Dr. Cervantes performed. He definitely is an angel <laughs> to me. An angel of hope. Hope for an artist with a vision. And for more information about the OptiCare and the Boston K-Pro procedure, visit OptiCarePC.com or call 1-800-CALL-I.